सॉल्व थ्री टैन स्क्वायर एक्स प्लस वन इक्वल टू टू बाई टैन स्क्वायर एक्स वेर एक्स लाइज बिटवीन जीरो टू वन एटी डिग्रीज दे टोल्ड यू टू सॉल्व सो यू शुड फाइंड द वैल्यूज फॉर एक्स सैटिस्फाइंग दिस इक्वेशन एंड ऑल्सो इट शुड लाई इन दिस इंटरवल जीरो टू वन एटी डिग्रीज द गिवन इक्वेशन इज थ्री टैन स्क्वायर एक्स प्लस वन इक्वल टू टू बाई टैन स्क्वायर एक्स हियर यू हैव टैन स्क्वायर एक्स एंड ऑल्सो हियर सो वॉट आई डू इज I take tan square x to be some other letter. Let us say y. Now this equation will become three in place of tan square x y plus one equal to two by y. Now you remove this y from the denominator. For that, we should multiply by y on both sides. so here we get 2 here you open up the bracket in this way 3y into y is 3y square plus 1 into y is y now bring this 2 to the other side for that you subtract 2 on both sides so we get 3y square plus y minus 2 equal to 0 okay now we got quadratic place this in the calculator to get the values for y so y equal to y equal to you get y values to be 2 by 3 and minus 1 okay now replace y by tan square x So tan square x equal to two by three. Tan square x equal to minus one. Now, here you should get tan x. That could happen if you shift square to the other side. So when you shift square to the other side, it will become square root. And here you need to consider both plus plus and also minus. So tan x equal to plus root two by three, or tan x equal to minus root two by three. Now to find the values for x, here it is tan and here it is positive. So now you check in what all quadrants is tan positive. it is all silver tea cup stan is positive in the first and the third see man this in this quadrant does not lie in this interval so you don't need to find this angle it is enough if we find the angle in the first quadrant and how do we find the angle in the first quadrant directly tan inverse square root 2 by 3 now here to find the values for x it is tan and here it is negative so in what all quadrants is tan negative tan is negative in the second and in the fourth the fourth quadrant does not lie in this interval so we don't need to find this angle to get an angle in the second we should do 180 minus tan inverse square root 2 by 3 remember this the negative sign is used only for selecting the quadrants once quadrants are selected do not place negative sign here again remember that now here to get tan x you shift square to the other side we get square root of minus 1 i cannot get the values for x so this we just neglect it now put this in the calculator you will get 39.2 here 
put this in the calculator you should get 140.8 so x values are 39.2 comma 140.8 this is our answer am i clear